Now he goes down again. Three, four, five. He went down from a big shot. Now he's got to have some big guts to move along. You're going to find out exactly what he's made of. Good combination to the body. Right hand by Lewis. All right, what's the answer here, Teddy? I mean, time and time again, he is getting hit with headshots by that right hand. The answer is not going to help him. The answer is to go back to the gym and be taught properly how to get away from that punch. Probably too late now. Don't fight his fight. And that round is underway, and we are halfway through the scheduled slate. You need to block more! Watch the hook! Up top with the right hand. Punches and bunches, combination up top. He's going to need to dig deep right now because what side we're seeing side, here is a fighter who's fading right in front of our eyes. Well, he's going to need a shovel to go that deep. Let's see some more head movement. Scores well to the head with the right hand. Right to the belt line. And now committing to that midsection as the target with the combination punching. Returns the favor with a right hand of his own. Lewis is showing us a great display of one of the best elements of defense, Teddy. And that is your ability to make your man miss by moving your head. And now what his opponent has to do is he has to understand, hopefully he's been taught this, that yeah, the head moves, but the body doesn't. The body is stationary right in front of you. Right now his opponent should not be going to that head. He should be going downstairs. Clean shot, returning fire. Well done by Lewis. There it is. Can he beat the count? I don't think so here, Teddy. Now I know where they got that saying. Falling like a sack of potatoes. Four, five, six, seven, eight, get up. It's over. Fight is over. Lewis 